Exploring Your Higher Self, A Guide to Understanding This Profound Concept. Hello, everyone, welcome to our channel. Today, we're going to dive into a fascinating English phrase that's not just a language lesson but also a journey into self-discovery. The Higher Self. Understanding this term is not just about language, but also about culture and philosophy. So, let's get started and unravel the mystery of what the higher self really means. The term higher self is often found in spiritual and philosophical discussions. It refers to a part of a person that is beyond the physical or ordinary consciousness. It's believed to be the source of wisdom, insight, and a deeper sense of understanding that transcends everyday experiences. Key Characteristics Non-physical, it's not about your physical body or appearance. Wise and insightful, believed to have a deeper, wiser understanding of life and your purpose. Inner Guidance, acts as an internal moral compass or guide. While the concept is spiritual, the phrase can be used in everyday English too. People might say they're in touch with their higher self when making decisions that require deep thought or moral judgment. It's used to express a state of greater awareness or understanding. Examples in sentences. When I meditate, I feel connected to my higher self. Listening to my higher self helped me make the right choice. Understanding the higher self also requires a bit of cultural insight. The concept is deeply rooted in various spiritual and philosophical traditions around the world. It's often associated with personal growth, self-improvement, and spirituality. Key Influences Eastern Philosophies Concepts similar to the higher self are found in Hinduism and Buddhism. New Age Thought The term is popular in New Age circles, emphasizing personal spiritual development. As English language learners, understanding phrases like higher self is crucial because it helps you grasp the cultural and emotional nuances of the language. Such phrases enrich your vocabulary and enable you to understand and participate in more complex and meaningful conversations. I hope this exploration of the higher self has been enlightening for you. It's not just a phrase. It's a window into deeper aspects of language, culture, and personal philosophy. Thank you for joining me today, and I look forward to our next language adventure together. Remember, language learning is not just about words, but also about the ideas and cultures they represent. Keep exploring and stay curious.